Our client feels that Mr. Walker is a complete hypocrite and does not deserve to be a United States Senator from the state of Georgia. We don't need people in the U.S. Senate who profess one thing and do another. Herschel Walker says he is against women having abortions, but he pressured me to have one. A woman has claimed that Georgia GOP Senate hopeful Herschel Walker pressured her to get an abortion in 1993. The woman was identified only as Jane Doe in a Zoom call with reporters. The accuser met the football legend in the 1980s and says the two continued an affair into the 1990s. She had voice recordings, hotel receipts, and a handwritten poem in which she allegedly declared his love. The woman provided evidence of the romantic relationship and Walker's knowledge that the woman was about to terminate her pregnancy. After discussing the pregnancy with Herschel several times, he encouraged me to have an abortion and gave me the money to do so. Doe said she came forward because she heard Walker deny allegations from another woman who claimed the football star had also paid for her abortion. Doe said she knew that the other woman's claims were legitimate, despite the denial from Walker. I saw him state that the woman's claims were not true because he never signed any cards using the letter H. I knew that was not true because he had often signed letters to me using H. Walker has voiced strict anti-abortion policies. But a bombshell report released earlier this month accused Walker of paying for another woman's abortion. Walker and his Democratic opponent, Senator Raphael Warnock, are in a high-stakes race for Georgia's Senate seat. Despite Walker's scandals, the Republican Party, both local and national, has continued to support him. Well, I've seen this movie before, folks. Uh, I remember the Kavanaugh storyline really well. We have seen this movie before, and we're not going to put up with it. TeamHerschel.com to every fair-minded Georgian. This stuff needs to stop.